Well, I think, you know, the fact that we actually played a tournament there already and had success certainly bodes well for us moving forward. You know, one of the things I thought happened in the Beanpot both games were that they were nerves. And I think when you have a team as young as ours and you get in that environment, I think that can be the case. But I'm hoping that the fact that we've gone through that already once will put us a little bit more at ease Friday night. Um, well, obviously, our, our main goal is to get to the Garden at the beginning, like you said. Um, it's also really, really fun to play in front of all the fans, all of our fans. Um, when you get there, so um, it's gonna be a really cool experience, and uh, it's a lot of it's the first time for a lot of our freshmen too, so it's really cool for them as well. Uh, yeah, um, you know, we're really excited obviously for the weekend, a uh, big weekend ahead of us. But you know, it's going into the two games, uh, possibly you know, obviously the first game on Friday. We just want to play BU hockey. You know, it's just like every other game basically. I love our mindset over the last three games. You know, from start to finish, I thought we were ready to play. I thought there was a real mental edge to our game. You know, obviously we have some skill. Uh, but I thought we really played 60 good minutes for three straight games at an important time of the year. I mean, if you're going to have a chance to have success in the playoffs, you've got to have a mental edge. You can't get rattled. You can't waver. You've got to be committed to the cause. And I thought over the last three games, we've played as well as we have all year. I think it is. I think, you know, because we have, I think we have a, a good level of skill. We've got some toughness to us. We've got great goaltending. I think we have all the elements to have success in that setting. And, you know, the one time we've had the opportunity to prove it, we won the tournament. So I think there's definitely a correlation to what went on in the bean pod and hopefully what's going to happen here this weekend. Um, I think it's really good for the team. I'm, I mean, after uh, these, these two games, I mean, I, actually, like, these two teams are also winner go home teams. Um, every game from here on, here on out, it's going to be, uh, we're going to be playing teams a lot of desperation um, and it's going to be winner go home for everyone. So obviously it's, it's good to play those teams right now when we don't have a winner go home uh, mindset. But um, it's going to be really tough for the rest of the way, and it's good to prepare uh, this weekend. Uh, you know, obviously they're going to bring their A game, and uh, I feel like, you know, we get every team's best game, you know, every game we play. So I think we're going to be used to it, and uh, we're going to be up for the challenge. Well, it means a lot to us, obviously, for the tickets to sell out that fast. It means a great deal. Um, we have some of the best fans in the, in the country, so they come out and support us wherever we are, no matter uh, how far we are away. There's always BU fans in the stands, so uh, it's really something really special for us. Uh, yeah, confidence is pretty important. And, uh, you know, when you get rewarded, you know, in that way, uh, obviously it gets your confidence up. But I'm just trying to play the same way, you know, as I've been playing all year, just making a simple and right play. Yes, um, they're obviously a really, really good team, a really good coach team. They've won, I think they've won nine of the last ten games. So that's uh, really special for them. Um, but also, uh, like you said, win or go home, a desperation team. So it's going to be a battle out of them. So obviously they're a very good team. They beat us early in this year. So uh, we have to play hard if we want to win.